Let's begin with a word of prayer and we'll move right along into today's lesson. We thank you, Lord, for this time we have to learn and grow. We seek to do the best we can and add to what we know. We love you, God, with all our hearts and to others' love we show. Pleasing you is our goal, not to our lesson we should go. In Jesus' name, amen. I believe in Jesus Christ, the Messiah who died and was resurrected from the dead to save humanity from sins. He is my Lord, Master, Boss, and Savior. I love God, I love myself, and I love others with the God kind of love. I believe the Bible is inspired by the Spirit of God and is the basis for morality, rights, and wrongs. I look to the Spirit of God to understand God's intent behind every letter of the Bible. I abide by this intent, and I live to honor God in thought, in word, and in deed. I believe there is a heaven to gain and a hell to shun. Father, please give me grace and mercy to please you more. This is my morality creed. In the name of Jesus, amen. Hello, Hero. Welcome to Hero Smart Academy. My name is Mrs. Nita. In today's lesson, we're going to talk about how to use an abacus. So let me demonstrate for you. I put together the original abacus that we found online, sort of uh, modifying it a little bit to match the one you have in your workbook, okay? So here you have HTU. H represents hundreds, T for tens, and U for units. Hundreds, tens, and units. And um, the way this works is if you put two beads over here, let's just say two, that would be equivalent to two hundreds. No tens, no units, it'd be just two hundreds, how you would read this abacus. If I put three beads here, two beads there, and one bead there, that would be three hundred, two tens, what's two tens? Count by ten, uh, uh, two tens, that's twenty, and one unit, that'd be three hundred plus twenty plus one, three hundred twenty-one. If I were to say five beads here, three beads here, and six beads here, that would be five hundred, three tens, and six units, that'd be five hundred thirty-six. Just in case you need to see it demonstrated in written form, let me show you on the board. The very first um, one you see on the board is five, H represents hundreds, the seven is tens, and the two is units, so that would be five units seven tens and two units, 500, seven tens and two units. Let me show you what that would look like if we were to write it out. Okay, so here you have 500, seven tens plus two units. How do you write 500? Well, 500 is just five zero zero. How do you write seven tens? Well, you just need one zero, right? You just need one zero, so add your first number, your seven, and then add one zero. And how do you write two units? Well, that's just the number two. Make sure you put all of the values, the figures, uh, make it far right aligned, okay? That way they can all add up correctly. You wanna put, um, uh, put it up to the right. Okay, so if we were to add this together, we have a vertical addition, zero plus zero plus two, which is two. Zero plus seven, <clears throat> which is just seven. And five plus nothing is 572. So that's how that would work. Um, that's the number you saw on the abacus. But let's just do a few more just in case. We have three H plus three hundredths plus eight tenths plus one unit. How would that look? Well, we write three hundred. Eight tens is 80, right? Eight, 10 times is eight, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80. And one unit, which is one. If you were to add that all the way up, you'd go straight down. That's one, eight, three, that's 381. And at this point, I expect you to be able to just look at the board and read it. Three hundreds, eight tens, one unit, 381, 381. 
but we're just writing it out just in case. Finally, we have 800, that's 800, six tens, which is 64 units. Just write it straight out. That's four, six, and eight. That, boys and girls, is how you would write, how you would uh, sum that. That's all I have for you today. Thank you so much for coming to class and being a part of today's lesson. Please do not forget to complete the exercise in your workbook. But until next time, remember, Jesus loves you. So do we. Goodbye. I'll be your hero's body, and as you study with heroes born, I will be your friend.